particular to find the ways for each child to live up to his or her God-given potential. I've traveled across our country over the last months listening and learning, and I've put forward specific plans about how we're going to create more good-paying jobs by investing in infrastructure and clean energy, by making it possible once again to invest in science and research and taking the opportunity posed by climate change to grow our economy. At the center of my campaign is how we're going to raise wages. Yes, of course, raise the minimum wage, but we have to do so much more, including finding ways so that companies share profits with the workers who help to make them. And then we have to figure out how we're going to make the tax system a fairer one. Right now, the wealthy pay too little and the middle class pays too much. So I have specific recommendations about how we're going to close those loopholes, make it clear that the wealthy will have to pay their fair share and have a series of tax cuts for middle class families. And I wanna do more to help us balance family and work. I believe in equal pay for equal work for women, but I also believe it's about time we have paid family leave for American families and join the rest of the world. During the course of the evening tonight, I'll have a chance to lay out all of my plans and the work that I've done behind them. But for me, this is about bringing our country together again. And I will do everything I can to heal the divides, the divides economically because there's too much inequality, the racial divides, the continuing discrimination against the LGBT community so that we will work her. together. Okay, and I yes, can't, but you finally, can. fathers will be able to say to their daughters, you too can grow up to be president.